Yo, XRP and XLM are the most talked about cryptos right now in the payment sector, but which one is better? In this video, I'm going to be comparing the employee profiles of actually both companies, Ripple and Stellar, to see who comes out on top. My people, I hope you've been enjoying the past 24 hours because you know what you get over here? Another blessed DLT episode from Live Capital. Now, Ripple and Stellar, I mean, are two of the hottest cryptos in the payment sector, but they're both up there in value. But which one is really worth the investment? I'm going to be comparing the employee profiles of both of these companies to see who's actually going to come out on top. Now, as you guys could see here, let's really firstly ask ourselves a question. Who is Ripple? Now, you guys can see here, we're looking at the official website from Ripple. They're boasting to everyone business impact powered by crypto or crypto means business. They're going to be transforming the way that we move and manage and tokenize our value. As you guys can see here, they also boast some prominent partners here, Bank of America, Novati, SABB, really working together with Ripple with their enterprise grade solutions to make faster, more transparent, more cost cost-effective cross-border payments versus traditional financial services. So really quickly, how they're capable of doing this is they actually utilize XRP. This coin here that's a part of the XRPL ledger. If you're actually interested in getting yourself some XRP right now, you can get some on Binance, FTX, and KuCoin. Now let's actually see the employee profile here with Ripple, building a future with global impact. The team here, the Ripple team is working on the next generation of crypto solutions. Either you're, whether, whether you're looking for a role as an engineer in San Francisco or an engineer in London, Ripple has a place to build something transformative. So really quickly, you guys could see here, they're showing all the departments they're boasting from London to Singapore. They need a staff partner engineer in India, Sydney, uh, Singapore staff partners and technical service engineers, lead design engineers, um, lead, lead digital designers in San Francisco, and as well, they need software engineers in London. A few engineering jobs, as you guys could see, Ripple needs quite a bit of help in where they're really planning on going. Corporate controller director out in Singapore, they need a senior IT support manager in San Francisco, head of product marketing for RippleNet San Francisco. So if you may be living in these areas and you're interested in learning how you can move forward in the digitization of tokenizing value and the Internet of value, I'd consider maybe joining if you have the credentials to be a partner solution director for central banks in London and uh, the U.S. and Singapore. Now let's ask, who is Stellar? Stellar is an open network for storing and moving money. You guys could see here, it's borderless, limitless, powerful. Stellar really makes it possible to create and send and trade digital representations of all forms of money, all forms of dollars, all forms of pesos, even Bitcoin, pretty much anything. It's designed so all the world their financial systems can work together on a single network. All right. So how they're capable of doing this is, of course, securing it through lumens called XLM. XLM, that's how they're securing this actual network. So what is actually XLM used for? It's going to be serving several different functions on the network. Mainly, though, it's going to be used to pay users for transaction fees and act as a intermediary, an intermediary or a bridge to enable that trade between multiple currencies fast, easily and at the lowest cost possible. XLM must be maintained in those accounts for the lumens to work as intended. So right now, as you guys could see, because XLM is actually uh, decentralized and non and nonprofit, the Stellar Development Foundation currently has jobs that are open. If you're interested in uh, engineers that might be listening or any core uh, managers towards core protocol engineering, they have openings in New York and San Francisco. 
Also as well for engineering, you have principal soft, uh, software engineers and as well senior full stack engineers. Any people for marketing as well, a creative director is needed in San Francisco and a digital marketing director is needed as well. So let's really ask ourselves the question, what are the real differences here? In terms of organization size, Ripple tends to be a larger organization with more sustainable, substantial capital. After all, st after all, Stellar is targeting a smaller pool of users when compared to Ripple. So you can kind of see that Stellar has branded itself to help rather than to profit from the public. So if you want to actually get yourself some XLM, right now it's available on Coinbase, Binance, and KuCoin. But which one is truly better for you? Let us know in the comments, my friend. I thank you for making it with us and continue to stay over here on this side and be blessed. I'll holler at you later. Peace.